Hey everyone, today I'm releasing my new Mage UI and Vigoras pack covering all three specs, Frost, Fire, and Arcane. All my user interfaces are entirely free, so you can proceed to download them from my website link in the description below. And in the links below, you will also find two more videos. The first video is a basic guide on how you can install my UI, and more importantly, customize your UI to track your own trinkets, spells, and other advanced logic. The second video is a 90 minute long VOD, showing you how I built an entire user interface from scratch together with Twitch chat using Windwalker as an example. And all these revamped Wikorats are also now foreign language compatible, so it works even if you're not playing the English version of the game. And with that out of the way, let me walk you through the components of my UI for each spec so you know exactly how they function after you import them into your own game. Let's start off with the Frost Mage. As usual, the top row tracks your rotational abilities, which is the bread and butter of the buttons you will press. And when the abilities are on cooldown, the icons will be desaturated and grayed out. As usual, we do not track abilities that do not have a cooldown associated with them. The core abilities here include Ice Lance, which glows when you have the fingers of Frost buff, as well as a flurry icon that glows when your Brain Freeze proc is active. You will also see I've tracked both the cooldowns of Frozen Orb, as well as the duration for which it is up when being used. We are also tracking Blizzard, Icy Veins, before rounding off the roll with your Covenant abilities, which changes based on the covenants you pick. If you have talented for Ebon Bolt, Comet Storm, or Ray of Frost, those will be tracked as well. If you'd like to track an unused trinket in this row, you can. My how to install video will show you how to customize it. The second row tracks various utilities and cooldowns. That includes Cone of Cold, Frost Nova, Ice Block, Cold Snap, Ice Barrier, Mirror Image, Invis, Alter Time, and Spell Steel. Moving on to the elements above the icons, you will see five small horizontal blue bars that represent the number of icicles buff built up. You will also see two horizontal bars that represent your shimmer charges. If you did not talent for shimmer, it merely tracks your blink cooldown. Above that all is your buff bar that tracks various important buffs including chain reaction, ice block, icy veins, radiant spark, rune of power, alter time, ice barrier, and invisibility. And that sums up the frost mage, let's talk about the fire mage next. The top row tracks your rotational abilities, which is the core of the buttons you will press. And when the abilities are on cooldown, the icons will be desaturated and grayed out. Again, we're not tracking abilities that do not have a cooldown associated with them. The core abilities here include Phoenix Flame, Combustion, Meteor if you ever talent into that, as well as a Flame Strike Tracker where the icon is desaturated when no Flame Strike is active. When Flame Strike is active, it tracks the duration of your latest Flame Strike patch. The rest of the row then tracks Rune of Power or Focus Magic, Dragon's Breath before rounding off the row with your Covenant abilities that varies based on the Covenant you've picked. The second row tracks various utilities and cooldowns that includes Decurse, Frost Nova, Ice Block, Blazing Barrier, Mirror Image, Invisibility, Alter Time, Spell Steel, etc. And now moving on to the elements above the icons, you will see three orange bars that represent your Fire Blast charges. And note they assume you have talented for Flame On which tracks all three charges. You will also see two blue horizontal bars that represent your Shimmer charges. If you did not talent for Shimmer, it merely tracks your Blink. Above all of that is your buff bar that tracks various important buffs and durations, including Combustion, Ice Block, Rune of Power, Alter Time, Invisibility, etc. And that sums up the Fire Mage, let's talk about the Arcane Mage. Similarly for Arcane, the top row tracks your rotational abilities and when they're on cooldown, they'll be greyed out. The row starts by tracking your clear casting procs as the first icon, and it will glow when you get a proc, signaling that your next Arcane Missile or Arcane Explosion is free and channels 20% faster. It then follows to track Arcane Barrage, Touch of the Magi, Arcane Power, Presence of Mind, and Arcane Orb if talented. The row then rounds off with your Covenant abilities that changes based on your Covenant. The second row tracks various utilities and cooldowns that includes Evocation, Frost Nova, Ice Block, Arcane Barrier, Mirror Image, Rune of Power, Alter Time, Spell Steel. And moving on to the elements above the icons, you will see a pink horizontal bar that builds up over time to signify the number of arcane charges you have. You will also see two blue horizontal bars that represent your shimmer charges. If you did not talent for shimmer, it merely tracks your blink. There is also a white digit in the middle that signifies your percentage mana left. And above all of that is your buff bar and it tracks various important buffs and durations including ice block, radiant spark, arcane power, and presence of mind. And that my friend sums up the walkthrough of my UI for the three specs of a mage and the shadowlands. You can find a step-by-step -step video install guide in the description below that covers how to install the UI in three simple steps as well as answers to some FAQ 
including how to track your own abilities, trinkets, how to move the weak auras and scale them, amongst other questions. My website where you download the UIs also have detailed instructions on how to install them. All feedback and questions are welcome. For feedback, definitely drop them in my Discord community and I'll update the weak auras over time to address bug fixes and errors. If you have questions about the UI, feel free to drop by my live stream. I stream most days of the week and my Twitch handle is in the description below. Happy to answer any of your questions. If this video is helpful, do subscribe to my channel. I publish daily Shadowlands and World of Warcraft content here and I will also release class week auras for every single spec and class in World of Warcraft. Lastly, a big thank you to my Patreon subscribers for supporting me. You folks make it possible for me to build and maintain the user interfaces for all the classes and a big thank you to you for watching the video. Take good care and enjoy the user interfaces. The I love don't care too much for the unpaid bills on the bedroom floor. I love lives on cheap wine and singing songs to a wasted sunrise. With you, you, with you, I feel like I am. With you, you, with you, I feel like I am. Somebody, somebody, somebody.